Right then, ladies and gents, welcome back to another video. James the Koi Whisperer. Nice way to start the video off. He's definitely giving me a good run for me money. That's an absolute stonk. Just happened to be the Koi Whisperer once again. Happy days. You're what's out then, son? Yep. You got a PB on here, son. He's a screamer. Right, that time of day. I'm about to make some more PVA bags up. Come on, son. 28.7 get in there my son if you drop it you lose it remember the days when you first got your hands on a catapult <laughs> i want to open this i absolutely love them thank you very much mate get full of rabbits all right let's get them back in hammer well we got a fish on happy days at least it's not a blank Nice way to start the video off. Jacob just turned up. Thank you, mother, for the miracle. Let's see if we can grab you a new PB today. What do you reckon? Yeah, I hope so. Let her go, lad. Yeah. Jake's all set up. Just about to cast out. Have a look, see you, Rig. Lovely, mate. Lovely. PVA bag. All right, get on then, son. Whack him out there. Stand just down in that patch and make it a bit easier for you. Slow it down. You want to talk then, son? Yep. I have actually book peg free for him on this lake. I want to keep an eye on him. He's fishing over there. He's right next to me. Makes it a little bit easier. Best peg on the lake's that one over there. But this peg was reserved or booked or whatever it is, and no one's turned up. The thing is with this lake, you can book and turn on from different times. So yeah, now we're just waiting for those rods to start screaming. Happy day. Sometimes with a nine foot scopes, you really got to put a bit of leverage on them you ain't got the length when they're kiting around the side gaining this is what it's all about though that's an absolute stonk happy days jump you can see the smile on my face that is an absolutely quality fish absolute stonker that's why I came here. To be fair, to be honest with you, I'd have loved it if this screamed off on Jacob's rod. It just happened to be the Koi Whisperer once again. <laughs> He's in the back of this film grinning, thinking, Dad, I wish I'd caught that. But yeah, that's an absolute beast. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get the sling out, get him on the weigh scale, see where she's at. But that's a quality fish. I'm just going to grab him on the scales a minute and give you a weigh in. It's definitely a good fish. Zero me scales a minute and I'll give you guys a check in, but that's an absolute stonking fish. Scales are zeroed. Jake's gonna tell me what it says. Ho <laughs> ho. What's the weight? 28.7 ounces. 28.7. Get in there, my son. I'll take that all day long. Right, let's get her back. That's an absolute quality fish. Look at the shoulders on that, Jake. That's what I come here for. That would look mental in my koi pond, wouldn't it? Get in there, my son. All we got to do now is get the person behind the camera to catch his new PB. Come yeah. on, Jacob. Right, that time of day, I'm on the arrow. Jake's on the instant. Happy days. That's your lucky cup, innit, Jake? Yeah. Grab your lucky cup. Kettle's brewing. I'm about to make some more PVA bags up. And happy days. And I got the ring light on. That was a stonking fish, wasn't it? Yeah. Wish I caught that. That's double my PB. <laughs> double your PB. Well, yeah. time will tell, mate, won't it? Give us a favour. Move that towel. Oh, hello. Go on, get a live take on. Right arm rod. Right arm rod. Come on, my son. While the kettle's going. Come on, Jake. I think he's on, mate. Get on, son. Anything on? No. He done you, Jake. He done you. At least you had a, at least you had a bite. Yeah. So, you know what it's like when you're, when you're a teenager. Everyone a caught fishing remember the days when you first got your hands on a catapult. <laughs> Jake, are you liking that? Giving it a go, ain't ya? 
So he's just firing out some of his famous bread flakes. It's the fun side of it and teaching him how to do it. Having fun with that catapult, Jacob? Yeah. Certainly looks like you are. <laughs> I remember the days. I remember the days being young myself, having a bit of fun. I'd rather teach him how to do things right, to learn the ropes properly. That's part of the reason why he's in my swim. I can keep an eye on him for when if he makes a mistake or doing something wrong, I'm there to, to correct it or help him if he needs it. That said, look, I got me fork out because I'm about to cook me sausages up. So we got some lovely beef sausages I made myself. I got some nice fat pork and leek sausages I made as well. Made them up work on Friday. Happy, happy days. But there's what you call the absolute banger. You've got to love the ridge monkey. <laughs> you can cook anything you like in them. I love it. I absolutely love them. Right then, ladies and gents. A lot of you know that we've got an Amazon wish list down below in the comment section. And it's mainly for me and my son so we can get my son out. There's people out there that's asked me to put the list in place. Yeah, so we got a, we got a little parcel, haven't we? But the fishing channel and the fishing videos is what we're doing together, isn't it? Yeah. And you're enjoying doing it with me, aren't you? Yeah, little father-son thing. Little father-son thing, as he says, which is good. It's a great bonding time. Getting him into the hobby, everything costs money. All of his, his equipment, the wish list there. There's some stuff there that we'll use together. There's some stuff there which will purely be just for Jacob. But there's certain things you still need, isn't there, as well? Yeah, there and is uh, stuff I still need. Yeah, and I'm slowly getting bits and pieces for him, but it ain't cheap. I want to open this. I'll let Jake read the little message for us, but got the old new merchandise. I'm ordering Jake one of these. Now I'm really happy with the hoodies. But what have we got then? A gift from Alex Gosley. Alex Gosley. What's that one say? Hi James, hope you and your boy keep enjoying the fishing. Tight lines by the thank your mother for the rabbits from Alex. Thank you very much, mate. Very, very much appreciated. Oh mate, he's done, he's spoilt ya. Check that out. He bought him a load of cart rigs, quarter hook beads. So thank you very much, Alex. Very much appreciated from me and Jacob. What do yep. we say? Thank, thank you, your mother, mother for, for the, the rabbits. rabbits. If you drop it, you lose it. Get on the good old sausage, sausage Sammy. Got to have the HP. Lovely. Is that enough? Yep. That's what you call the absolute. Hammer. So yeah, it's gone a bit quiet to be fair. Got a few hours left of the session. I'm hoping Jake can uh, pull one out. But I just wanted to add into the video. Look at the conditions that I'm fishing in. Absolute shit pet. I was thinking to myself, if I owned any venue, no matter what it is, I'd put gravel down. I'd put, well, not even gravel, wood chip, I think is the best. What do you guys prefer? Wood chip, gravel, or just straight slurry? I prefer a nice wood chip area not just on the peg but a decent place to bivy up as well because this lot here is absolutely nightmare i know one thing mrs whisper ain't gonna like all this mud going in the car jacob's in J jacob's in boy if he goes towards my line don't worry about it just keep the tension on boy all right what's it feeling like it's feeling quite big feeling good yeah that was a right screamer too, boy, wasn't it? Yeah. He's taking you up the channel. Go on, Jake. Right over near the net, mate, so you don't go around the back. Keep the tension on him. You got your drag set right? Over there. Look at that, boys. He's a screamer. He's a screamer. Someone is happy. That's why it pays to rebate your rod, Jake, sometimes, mate. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't even out of five for two minutes. How long was it out? About two minutes. Good fish, Jake. It could be a good fish, mate. Could be a PB on the cards, Jake. Could be a oh. PB. I just see his tail. You got a PB on here, son. Lift him up. And he's your son. Right then, ladies and gents. So... We've got an absolute cracking fish in the net, but possible PB on the cards. So, bin zeroed, up the scales then, see where we're at. Oh mate, you haven't just, you haven't just beat your PB, you've absolutely smashed your PB mate. What Guess what it? it is? What is it? 17 pound. 
Keep it still. £17 4 ounce, I'll give you. £17 4 ounce, son. Yes, happy? Do you happy about that? Yeah. Right, pick him up then, Jake, and we'll show everyone what it looks like. This is my new uh, PV now. £17 and 4 ounces. Never forget the ounces, because that always matters at the end of it. It's an absolutely beautiful leather carp. And uh, I just want to say thank you to my dad for teaching me to fish, because like experiences like this just makes a massive smile on a kid's face, just like mine. <laughs> well made up for you, mate. Happy days. Look at that, guys. Absolutely stunning leather carp. Cracking, mate. Well done, mate. Thank you, mother, for the rabbits. Thank you, mother, for the rabbits. Right, let's get them back in. Absolute quality. Fist pump. Bosh. Like Happy days, mate. You're lucky you don't get a bucket of water over you. Because when you beat your personal best, you normally get drowned by a bucket of water. <laughs> I don't know who's more fussing, me or Jacob, but to be fair with you guys, well made up for him. I'm glad he's caught a decent fish, a decent quality fish. That being said, look, we're just on pack down, coming to the end of the day. I'm glad he got one this time of year because it ain't always easy, but he has. So that there's what you say. Thank your mother for the rabbits. So I'll start packing up my gear. Rods are staying out till last minute. Hopefully we can bag another one, but I can't guarantee anything. We're more than happy with this session. See that look? That's what you call a proper carper. Looking after his gear. Teach him well, and they'll do it properly. Clean your gear before you go home. Keep it tidy. Right then guys, so I am back home. I completely forgot, I forgot to end the video. <laughs> that being said, what an amazing trip. The weather's come out absolutely banging now this afternoon. I managed to get all of the gear tidied up, all of it packed away. As you can see, look, I am still in my fishing gear. I have literally just got home, but I'm going to end the video here. That's me Koi Pond if you're new to the channel and you haven't seen it and you've been wondering why I say the Koi Whisperer. It's because I keep Koi. That being said, look, hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you, mother, for the rabbits. And I'll see you on the next one. Tight lines, everyone.